In my 15 years as a cardiologist, the one fact that continues to bother me is that every year, 7.2 million people will lose their lives to a heart attack. One and a half to three million of them will come from India alone. Right? Our countries together over the next decade will spend 20 trillion fighting one of the world's largest killers, heart disease. But I don't want you to focus on the 7.2 number, but on the fact that 50% of these lives can be saved if their heart attacks are diagnosed within 90 minutes and treated. However, in most parts of the world, it is not 90 minutes, but it is closer to 360 minutes. Even if we can save a few minutes from there, we can save a million lives. It is 10.30 p.m. in India now. And what you will see on the video is actually an image of a primary care clinic. And what you will notice are long queues of people that are waiting to see the doctor. What you will also notice is it's a setting that is very typical of a low resource environment. And what do we mean by a low resource environment? It's an environment that does not have the right infrastructure, either in the form of technology or in the form of resources. So talking about Dr. Charit's statistics, what we're trying to deal with here is two problems. One, how do we enable these environments with the right technology, in this case, an ECG machine, with which you could easily diagnose if a person is at risk of a cardiac disease or not. But more importantly, once diagnosed, how do you now impart the right level of care, and therefore, how do you train these resources who are doing the diagnosis to be efficient and work at the top of their license? And that's really where GE and TRICOG come together as a solution. What we're going to do now is go live to this primary care clinic and meet Dr. Rao at this setting. This is the video that's running on the screen that we just spoke about. The video actually shows long cues. In many cases, this is very typical because it is a site that represents a scenario where it takes an average of four to six hours for patients to actually get from their homes to a site like this, in some cases an overnight journey. That's not all. In many cases, what also happens is after diagnosis, many people see a fall-off point. There is really no follow-up after the diagnosis is passed because they don't know what needs to be done to undergo therapy. They don't have financial services and backing. That is something that we're trying to address with this solution. And if we could go live to Dr. Rao at the primary care clinic now. Hi, I am Dr. Ramna Rao. Welcome to our village clinic. We are in Tibegur, a rural setup away from Bangalore. Here is a rural clinic in a rural setup. We have here Ramapa with a history of chest pain and breathlessness. And I would like a cardiologist to have a look at him now. But in a rural setup, a cardiologist, not possible, not really possible. I would like an ECG taken for him. I have here a GE. MAC 600 ECG machine with a tricog communicator. I would like an ECG taken for him now. There, the machine is on. It is now recording his ECG. As it records, it is also communicating through the tricog communication device with the tricog central hub where a cardiologist like Dr. Cherit would be already seeing this ECG to give me his valuable opinion. There, I have his ECG. I am looking at Ramapa's ECG, but I am not a cardiologist. I want to know what this ECG says. A cardiologist's opinion at this time is of immense value to me and to this poor patient. I would like to wait for their opinion. Let's wait for a few seconds. Thank you, Dr. Rao. And why are the TRICOG platform 
An examination done anywhere in the world can be viewed by a specialist such as I in real time on a laptop or a mobile device like I'm doing here on stage in San Diego. And as we wait for the exam to come in my queue, here are some of the ECGs that have been done today and from some remote locations all across India. Mr. Ramappa is an example of how we are helping people in rural India. And here is his ECG. As you can see here, and the ECG is loaded, our TRICOG platform enables a specialist to give a real-time diagnosis aided by algorithms. And in the back, 20 specialists work along with our machine learning algorithms to ensure accuracy and to enable scale of our system. So I'll go ahead and quickly make this diagnosis. And for the physicians out here, you can see that there are T-wave inversions. This patient who has chest pain requires further management. And it is not something that you would want to ignore. Without the system, he would be treated for acidity. And I'm just going to write IHD to be ruled out. And with the hashtag Fortune Health. <laughs> and within a minute, the diagnosis goes back to India to that doctor so that he can continue to treat his patients. Dr. Rao, over to you. There, I have the TRICOG team response. A cardiologist like Dr. Cherit has already seen Ramapha's ECG and is telling me what the diagnosis is. There. Here is the diagnosis of Ramapha. It is so clear. It clears up my mind. It removes my confusion as what to do with him next. This is a serious problem which we face every day. You can see in this clearly what the tricor cardiologist, Dr. Cherit, has opined. Every day, we see many patients with definite cardiac symptoms. We see patients with doubtful cardiac symptoms. We see patients with gastric symptoms coming with chest pain. We see so many chest pains which are non-cardiac. The only way we can differentiate is by taking help. And TRICOG has, with the help of GE, has been of immense value to me and in our village clinic. It has been able to clear my doubts and make me more confident to treat such cases. It saves me immense amount of time, very precious time, minutes and seconds, which could mean life and death for this poor patient. He cannot afford a cardiologist, he cannot afford a cardiac opinion. But here you have it in front of you in minutes. I thank wholeheartedly the TRICOG people, TRICOG team and the cardiologists and the GE company for assisting me in this noble cause in treating these very poor patients absolutely free. Without their help, he would have gone untreated, unnoticed. I'm very grateful to TRICOG and GE. I thank you all today for visiting us in the village clinic. Thank you very much. Thank you, Dr. Rao. Thanks for that live demo. So how did this solution actually come about? You know, thank you. So four years ago, Dr. Charit had reached out to our team in India talking about the need uh, to solve for this problem. And uh, what we clearly realized were we were trying to fix three problems. First, we needed a device to acquire the ECG. So going to a primary care clinic, identifying the right infrastructure to be put in place. That was one piece of it. The second one was the data ag acquisition and the aggregation piece to run the offline analytics. It was the second piece of it. And that's where TRICOG comes in. And the last piece, which is equally important, is what happens after diagnosis, because you don't want to have a high follow-up rate. And that's where the TRICOG team actually runs a care management protocol to move these patients that are at risk to a point of stabilization and then get them into a catheterization lab where you can actually do an interventional procedure. So that entire solution took us about a year to implement, but today we can actually see impact in the terms of uh, the number of lives saved. 
In 2015, GE made a commitment to emerging market health and global health in general. We formed a business unit called Sustainable Healthcare Solutions. It was a $300 million investment that we made to develop technology solutions, but more importantly, to be a part of the larger ecosystem for public health. We clearly realized that this is nothing but a sliver in the long journey of delivering good care at reasonable costs and, and enabling lives, enabling good lives and outcomes for the 5.8 billion people in the world that don't have access to it. One of the things that we've done is we've created a global health accelerator called 5.8, and TRICOG is our first partner. Over the last two years, they now have 500 active sites of this technology in India. We're expanding them into Southeast Asia and Africa, and they are by far the largest AI company for cardiology in the world, I would presume with 250,000 ECGs in their bucket, but more importantly, the impact that they've delivered, more than 10,000 lives saved in the last couple of years, I think speaks volumes of what a solution like this can do. Sorry. Thank you. The, the underlying theme here has been tech, AI, and health. And with all of these, the aim of TRICOG is to give every patient who is suffering a heart attack from an 80% chance that the heart attack will take your life to an 80% chance that they will survive. Thank you very much for listening. Thank you. Thank you.